All right, everybody, this is Bill and Deb, and we stopped here at Bucky's uh, just east of Mobile off of I-10. Is that right, Jim? Yeah. yeah. And this is one of our loyal followers. He's been a loyal follower since day one, ever Amen. since we started the channel. <laughs> ever yeah. since you got out of your uh, mobile uh, Got out of the motorhome? Motor home. Yeah, wow. yeah. But uh, he doesn't live too awful far from here. We're not going to disclose his location. But uh, uh, we made arrangements to meet him here, and, uh, and we just love meeting with Jim. One of these days, we're going to stop and, and, and Actually, set up our trailer on your, on your property for a few days when we have time. Basically. But, yeah. But anyway, uh, Jim came bearing gifts. Yes, he did. <laughs> Let's get a shot of that first. There's we got uh, holy cow, Jack Daniels Tennessee Fire, and then look at that. We got us a case of Fireball, so I know what we'll be doing for a while uh, now. And it, that that'll last us because we kind of slowed down a little bit. By the way, uh, no, it should hopefully it'll last longer than that. <laughs> About a week, <laughs> it'll last a little longer than that, Jim, because uh, Deb's made me slow down. Yeah, we've slowed down a little bit. <laughs> but anyway. We just love Jim to death, and we communicate with him on a regular basis, and uh, we're always tickled to death when we get a chance to see Jim. So, well, you know what? We'll be back through this area on our we're way gonna back. Stop, we're going to stop and maybe visit we you. can actually stop and spend a few days. Yeah, we're going to stop and spend a few days that. with you uh, we would love to on do the that way back. We're going to figure out a way. But okay. anyway, uh, we're going to have to put some more fuel in this van and uh, get on down the road. Okay. We got a ways to go, Jim. All right, but. Uh, you got a long drive ahead of you. <laughs> but anyway, everybody, we're going to let you go for now. Uh, and uh, everybody say hi to Jim and remember Jim. He's been a loyal follower since day one. And we uh, we, re we appreciate all of our followers. Yeah. But uh, we just I'm love, give you love Jim to death. All right. Yeah. Anyway. And him too. Yeah. And okay. Him too. okay. All I'll right. Give him one. Here. <laughs> this is our buddy Jim. We just love Jim. Don't you love Jim? Absolutely. We've yeah. met so many super, super, super nice yeah. people. Jim, Jim has been a <clears throat> loyal follower of the channel ever. Just you know, well, just like we said previously, ever just about ever since we started this, and uh, he reached out to us probably a couple years ago, and then we ended up uh, you know trading uh, contact information and. He calls and checks on us now and then, especially when he watches a video where we, uh, you know, almost died. <laughs> I didn't know we had such videos. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, but he uh, he was mm -hmm. immediately calling and checking on us after we drove through all the rough weather the other day and everything. But well, we uh, had several reach out to us. Oh yeah, it yeah, was, a whole was, bunch. You of know, we are like I said, we have just met some yeah. really really nice people. Yeah. Anyway, we're sitting here at our next location on our trek to where we're going to be stationary for, you know, a few weeks. And uh, we're at... We're uh, in another, Florida. Yeah, we are in Florida. <laughs> but we're also at another... Uh, uh, close friend. Close friend that we met through the YouTube channel at, yes. on their property, uh, roughly 30 miles south of... Uh, Tallahassee. We try to stop by here, yeah. coming and going, right. and uh, then we meet them up on the road sometimes uh -huh. as well. Yeah, so. yeah. So that makes it really nice. But anyway, the main main thing that we're talking about right now, or what we thought we would uh, talk about, is just how uh, humbled we are, and how blessed we feel to have met so many wonderful people ever since we started this journey you know, over three and a half years well, ago. Well, we were just talking about this not very long ago, that we would never have met all of these awesome, wonderful people in several different states if we hadn't started this lifestyle. And, of course, the YouTube channel, because they reach right. out to us, and it's yeah. like, wow, you know, and, and it, it is amazing. Yeah, it is truly amazing. And uh, so, you know, this is our thanks to y'all. Yes. For the support that you've given us <laughs> along the way, uh, and uh, the encouraging all of, words, yeah, the, all the positive comments, and you know, we had several people <coughs> reach out to us when we were sick because everybody, where are you? Where are you? Are yeah. you guys okay? Right. <laughs> and right. that was like, oh my gosh, you know. But uh, anyway, <coughs> uh, the next thing is, I am so happy that we finally made it into Florida. Yes. You know, uh, what was the temperature back in Northwest Arkansas this morning? 29 this 29 morning. 29 degrees, and it's around... 
I well, think it's 64. Yeah, yeah, it's about 64 degrees. But it's thereabouts. not bright sun. <laughs> yeah, we got uh, some high, high clouds where we are, but that's okay. We'll take this and, you know, I'm able to sit here in shirt sleeves. Mm -hmm. Of course, Deb's wearing a sweater. I grabbed a sweater because I'm, I guess I'm getting acclimated to yeah. Florida weather. <laughs> but uh, on the run that we made yesterday from uh, Davis Bayou Campground, which is... Uh, near Ocean Springs. Ocean Springs, Mississippi. Thank you, dear. You're welcome. And by the way, uh, we got away a little bit later than we had anticipated. And the reason why <clears throat> is because we had released a video the day previous saying that we were currently at Davis Bayou. So uh, some other followers had to drop by, uh, you know, and say hi to us before we pulled out. And we're always and, yes. so humbled and so appreciative that you guys stop by to visit us. I mean, yes. it's amazing to us. <laughs> yeah, we are so humbled and we appreciate that so much. And we can't say that enough. No, we can't we say cannot. That. The only thing that I regret yesterday when those folks stopped by. Is we couldn't we actually out, sit down and visit for a little bit. That was one thing. <laughs> and the next thing was, how come, why didn't I pull out my camera? Because we just don't do that. Well, I it's know. just like last night. We were gathered with some close friends around the supper table, and we did think about pulling up. No, no. But we just don't you know, do that. I mean, well, we have so many wonderful things happening in our lives, but yeah. we don't film it all. <laughs> yeah, we don't film everything, and a part of it has to do with you know the uh, respecting the privacy of the folks. Yeah, some people don't like to be on camera. Yeah. Yeah, you know, go figure. and we just don't want to walk around shoving a camera in, in folks' no. face all the time. And no. Maybe we should do more uh, filming. Maybe we should. Anyway, we just wanted to take a brief moment and let you all know uh, what's happening and how everything is going. Uh, we're going to be here for three or four days or so, and then we head on out again. And this time we'll end up uh, 15 miles roughly the other side of Gainesville, Florida. And we'll be there for a little while at that spot. I guess because at that spot, you're supposed to be finishing my shower. Karen, he's supposed to be finishing my shower. Karen doesn't watch our videos. She just listens to them. That's okay. She'll hear it. Yeah, Brad watches the videos and she just listens in. I can Karen. understand that. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to be working on the shower while we're over there and try to get that the rest of that done. We got some trim work to do here and there and things like that. And we're trying to get And get the bathroom done. sink working. Now everybody knows that we haven't had a bathroom sink all this time. That's right. Thank you so much. Dear. You're welcome. I swear. Whatever I can do to be to, enlightening. Uh, to inspire me. <laughs> to inspire. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever we well, can do. <laughs> anyway, it's going to be nice to have the nice weather and everything in order to do this as long as it doesn't rain a lot. I have a pop-up tent. <laughs> it won't be cold. <laughs> you see what I have to look forward to? Anyway. Um, I'll be right there with you. And baby. I know we haven't mentioned it here in the last few videos, but you know the uh, what we refer to as the Spring Tiny House Adventures Rendezvous. Uh, is getting closer and closer all the time. Yes. And it will be held at Itchituckney Family Canoe and Cabins. Itchituckney Family Canoe and Cabins, which is near Fort White, Florida, February the 20th through the 27th. And as of right now, the campground is booked solid and there is a waiting list. Uh, but go ahead and get on the waiting list yeah. if you want to come because Sometimes people cancel for whatever reasons. I mean, yeah. there's health issues. Yeah. There's sometimes, you know, different so, things uh, that happen in but, life. You know, there are some folks on the waiting list, and uh, now there are campgrounds nearby. Now there is another <coughs> campground just like a mile down the road from there, Itchituckney Springs Campground. I think's the name of it. You can you know, Google it. You'll find it. Uh, but it's just like a mile down the road. But we we drove through it when we were there last time, and if I recall. Many of the sites were primitive sites, but they did have a few that had uh, hookups, you know, uh, water and electric, and I don't know if they had sewer or not at the site. We just drove but, through. We didn't. Yeah, we just kind of drove through, but it's just like a mile down the road from uh, Itchituckney Family Canoe and Cabins. And a lot of folks have reached out and asked us if it's okay if they just come and visit for the day. And sure. Absolutely. Sure. Sure. And uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, we have lots of people do that. We had several people do that at the uh, fall rendezvous uh, that we had in Arkansas. Right. Several people did that. Just come for the day. 
And in addition to that, mm -hmm. let's clear something up again. You are, you do not have to have a cargo trailer conversion to attend these rendezvous. No. No. You just have to want to do the lifestyle. Yeah. To enjoy the, getting out I and mean, enjoying nature and visiting people and we don't care what you camp in. No. <laughs> no. And it doesn't matter what it is. Uh, now, when we feature videos, walkthrough videos, yeah, we feature cargo trailer conversions uh, in the walkthrough videos. Or vans. But, or, or vans or schoolies or something like that. And I'd love to do a few schoolie uh, walkthroughs. I'd love to do but that. But it is not limited to, that. to that. No, absolutely not. You know. So do not let that hold you up. No. No. Come out. And get acquainted with these people. Enjoy it the way we do. It's just amazing. Yeah, it's absolutely amazing. Absolutely. And uh, we haven't laid out the itinerary yet, but we, we're feeling... I'm fixing to. Yeah, we, we feel like fairly <laughs> confident that we will be having um, a movie night. And what we're thinking about... Uh, if I can get Mary to bring the projector. Yeah. If we're able to have a movie night, we're thinking about the movie RV with Robin Williams. We watched that ourselves here a couple of weeks ago and, and got a kick out of it, and we think it would be a good one to show. So come and see us. If you, if you couldn't get a site, but if you live nearby, come out and see us at the Rendezvous. We'd love to visit with you, love to say hi. Uh, we are working on the itinerary. Did I say that right? Itinerary? I that that's correct? what I call it. I'm work oh, I've got it kind of in my head, but I haven't put it out there yet. But okay. I will be yeah. getting it out there and the of course, first there of will January. Be, there will be uh, one evening where I'm, I'm putting together a, a concert Music. and I'm trying to... Unfortunately, our daughter won't be able to join us, I don't well, think. Well, who knows? She may surprise us <laughs> at the last minute. You never know. But anyway, for now, we're going to let you go, folks. This is Bill and Deb with I Ride Tiny House Adventures. And you know exactly what we're going to say. We're not camping. We're living. Y'all get out there do some living and we will talk to you again soon bye bye now bye bye